a group, Saad and Kaduna Muslim Umar Development Association, has engaged some governorship candidates in the state. The group said the interface would help the residents know what each candidate can offer and hold them accountable when elected. Plus, the Venice correspondent Habila Dorafai's report is presented from our studios. Since the commencement of political campaigns, Groups, religious bodies and the civil society have been engaging candidates on the need to unite and seek lasting solutions, especially on insecurity in southern Kaduna. We have invited them, they came, we put questions across to them, we assess them based on the answers they gave us and we are also studying their own manifestos and we are in a position actually now to guide and advise people our own members who to vote. The essence of it is actually to interface with them, understand their own programs and positions vis-a-vis -vis our own situation and demand. Interface with all the political parties that have candidates uh, whom they have fielded in Kaduna State, all of the political uh, uh, parties. And the purpose is for them to let them uh, get the opportunity to tell us what they have for us. It was time for the governors to speak and convince the group about your manifestos. An all inclusive government means carrying everybody along because we are all indigenous and this land belongs to us. What we need to do to improve on the economic power of our citizens is what we are interested in which I have told you clearly that in the area of agriculture and solid minerals, that alone will wipe away poverty in Kaduna State. All the governorship candidates in attendance included Senator Suleiman Hunkui of the NNPP, Sani Yaya of YPP, Yahaya al Hassan Marafa of APM, Hayatu Din Makarfi of PRP and Timothy Adamu of AA. Peace accord was signed by the five governorship candidates for violence free elections in the state. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.